guys, it's me, Pedro, with my first experience is your key, the impossible boys. Thank you guys for this cool, awesome video. This video is the 200 subscriber milestone video. Thank you guys so very, very much for your awesome support of this channel and of the Perseverance Network, including my videos, other content from celebrities, interviews from like Neil Haley, uh, numerous different celebrities that have come on the Perseverance Network that are a part of it, uh, numerous different artists, uh, things that we've collaborated with numerous different types of people with different types of videos presentations is all sorts of this stuff on the channel if you're new to the channel and you're viewing this 200, subs 200 uh, subscriber milestone video, believe me, there's tons of content on here. There's interviews, there's inspirational videos, there's collaborations, there's all sorts of great stuff. And the thing is, is that we're not done. This is just what we've done just thus far. And believe me, is that making a community of 200 subscribers on YouTube is definitely a big deal to me. Uh, I, I don't care, you know, like tons of people out there, you know, are thinking, oh, 200 subscribers is small or things like that. The thing is, is that each person that subscribes and each person that becomes a part of the community is so significantly important to me that every time we hit like a new milestone like this, like the 100, 100 subscriber milestone, we're at 200 subscribers. I'm ready for that 300 subscriber mark. And, the, and you know, the thing is, is that I want more subscribers, not in the sense of for the idea of, you know, having more people or being able to say that I have the, a lot of subscribers, things like that. No, 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 no. That's not the point. The point behind having a lot of subscribers and, and going forward and wanting more subscribers is the idea to inspire and motivate and educate as many people as I humanly can and as much as I possibly can with either my story, collaborations, interviews, all these different things, custom videos, all sorts of different stuff. Um, so I want to say thank you to you guys. You guys are, you, you made this community happen. We are not 200 subscribers for YouTube and I'm ready for that 300 subscriber mark. I think we can do it. You know, we are in September of 2017 is when this video is being made. And I believe that November, December, uh, October, November, December, I believe in the top amount of time that's right here to now to right here to the end of the year. I think that we can get, I want to, I want to set a, uh, the realistic goal would be I want to get to 250 subscribers by the end of the year. Uh, my ideal goal, my my uh, out there goal, it's not so realistic, but it is definitely something I would absolutely love to see is 300 subscribers by the end of the year. Is, you know, are both of these possible? Yes, they're incredibly possible with your guys' help and your guys letting your friends and your family know and your uh, relatives, you know, letting your communities know about the inspirational and the motivational content on this channel it could happen um but i'm not going to require you guys to do it i'm not saying that you know like i said is i'm not doing this for the sake of having a giant following i'm doing this for the sake of i want to inspire and motivate and educate as many people as humanly possible so if you know someone that needs to be motivated and educated and inspired in many different ways send them my way send them to the perseverance network send them to my channel i am happy to both uh, help people out as much as possible as well as listen to people. I am a person that, you know, the, I, I, even though I'm like the face on the channel at the moment, like I, like you're watching this video and I'm here on, uh, on this video, right? That doesn't mean like, you know, if someone gives me a comment or someone says something or someone has an idea or someone wants to collaborate or things like that, that their voice is not inferior. Their voice is incredibly strong, powerful, important, and it's something I'm going to definitely draw attention to. So if you guys got any type of ideas, any type of comments, whatever it is, I want to incorporate it into the videos and the schedule that I'm doing. Uh, the reason being is because, you know, I can't do this alone. Building a community, building a, a a community of people who support each other as well as support, you know, ideals and things. It doesn't happen with one person. It doesn't happen alone. You can't, you know, just be a part of something and then not and then not work with other people. So the the idea is is that I want to create a community where there's tons of people that are both helping each other and then getting helped by, you know, either each other's stories or by my stories or by my videos. That is the ultimate point of what I'm trying to do, particularly on YouTube in a very personal, straightforward manner. Because I feel like on other networks, like you got like Twitter and Facebook and things, you know, they, they have like posts and you have links and you have hashtags and things like that. It's like, it's great because you know who you, you know, what they're posting and like some good ideas and some things behind it. But I feel 
that YouTube gives you a very, very more personal uh, perspective, a more personal kind of um, uh, conversation where, you know, you could actually see the person who's talking to you. You can actually view their video. You can actually comment. You can actually, um, you know, do response videos and things like that. Instead of just writing text on a screen, I can actually respond to someone in a video format, which I believe is more personal and creates this more connection between not only people to me and to you or the viewer, uh, but also the viewers to each other who, We'll be able to, you know, com communicate and support each other. That's ultimately my goals going into um, f the future for going to that 250 to 300 subscriber milestone is to cr start creating, you know, continue creating a community that supports uh, supports themselves, but also supports each other and supports ideals of positivity, of acceptance, of freedoms, of all sorts of different things. Um but like I said, is this is a 200 subscriber milestone video. It's awesome. It's incredible. It's great. You know, people are going to be like, oh, well, it's a tiny, you know, it's a tiny amount. You know, there's tons of channels out there that got thousands of subscribers, whatever. You know, and I'm going to be like, hey, you know what? The thing is, is that each of each person, each of you 200 people, you have decided to take time that you will never get back out of your lives to view my videos in some shape or form or to be subscribed or to look at the emails when my videos come out you get an email boom hey you're notified of the next video you're taking time out of your life that you're never going to get back and i have to treat that with a significant amount of importance because that's time you're not going to get back but it also is an ability for me to help um enrich your life and then for you to help enrich mine at the same time which is so vitally important of a community and, a, and, and incredibly important of any type of friendship so when p people think you know like 200 subscribers you know it's kind of small every person is incredible so to me 200 is fantastic 200 is fantastic and you know you have to understand is that if you are a small YouTuber, like you're smaller than me, like if you happen to be a subscriber and you have like maybe 5, 10, 20, 50 subscribers, things like that, right? That's incredible. Be proud of that. Be proud that you have subscribers, okay? Even if you have 10, if you have 5, whatever. Here's the thing. Like I said, is they're taking time out of their lives that they will never get back to view your videos and to encourage you and to help you out as well as they can help to encourage you as well. And it's it's a great thing it's an incredible thing and thus i really hope youtube stays this way i mean we're really starting to see a drive towards like youtube red and things like that where we're starting to get really monetizing and money oriented things like that i don't want youtube to change where we're going to be going towards you know a, a paid subscription type of idea that would just be bogus you know it uh, i the it ultimately if we get to that point where we start paying for our subscriptions for things, we start losing the um, the the uh, freedoms to not only create content but to view content and to have it as accessible as possible. Because once it becomes a monetary uh, type thing, it becomes not accessible to certain people. And thus, that's one thing I want to strive for is making sure that my channel is completely 100% accessible by those who have and who don't have money to subscribe. So thus, my channel is free to subscribe. It's not YouTube Red oriented and it never will be YouTube oriented, Red oriented. The only time the only times that uh, my channel or anything connected to me would be YouTube Red oriented is if we started doing collaborations with different people. But I would take it upon as much as humanly possible to make sure that those projects are as free as humanly possible because I do understand as being someone who's experienced low income that when you start putting money barriers in front of people... They, it ceases to it ceases to have the ability to have the freedoms to view and to be educated in a very personal manner and create a community around it because uh, I think also too that when people get into the, like the YouTube red and the things like that they get kind of wrapped around the money aspect of it and it's not about the money it's about the people who are viewing your channel because they are the most important your subscribers are the most important and that needs to be true for every YouTuber no matter how big or small you are there are people who have subscribed to you or taking time out of their lives that they will never get back to view your content. So what do you do? 
you have subscribers, you know, just like I've hit my 200 subscriber milestone, you know what it tells me? It tells me this. It tells me I got people viewing my videos and it tells me that I have, you know, that no matter how big or small your channel is, you have uh, you have a viewer. You have a chance to encourage and motivate and educate someone else. You have a chance to change somebody's life, to better their life in some shape or form that particular day. So what I see this as, I see 200 subscribers, I see 200 people that I can personally interact with and personally help out. And 200 people, you know, and this is not even saying towards subscribers. I mean, you might not be even be a subscriber. You might be viewing this video. There, You know, I've almost had, I think, like, what like uh almost 60,000 yeah things like almost 60,000 views or something like that I can't quite remember my channel but I mean you know there's tons of people who have viewed my videos who aren't subscribers and those people have opportunities to be inspired as well so it's just you know um it's it's just my thoughts it's just my thoughts I wanted to put my thoughts out there I wanted to tell you guys thank you so very very much for 200 subscribers like I said we're going to the 250 that is uh the realistic goal by the end of the year and if we can get the if we can do a push towards 300 subscribers that would be fantastic that would be awesome so uh 200 250 to 300 subscribers by the end of the year I believe we can do it otherwise thank you guys for viewing this video remember the perseverance is your key to the possible and I will see you guys in future videos